In this video, we're going to factor a difference of squares. So you can notice that you have a difference of squares when you have a square in the front term and a square in the back term, and there's no middle term. All right, so if there's no middle term, technically we have one binomial times its conjugate because that's how the middle term gets canceled, and we saw that in previous sections. So to factor this thing, what you do is simply is we take the, basically you square root this piece. So you'd have 2x for your beginning term for each piece, because 2x times 2x gives you the 4x squared. And then do the same thing with the square rooting here. You have 1 minus 5y, and then 1 plus 5y. So I have the conjugate of the first term written in the second term. That uh, ensures that the middle term will cancel out. So I get this negative 25y squared and this positive 4x squared. And when I multiply these together and then the outside together, those two terms cancel. So this factors to these two binomials. Let's try another one. Again, I have no middle term, all right? So the middle term's been canceled, which means I have two binomials that are conjugates of each other. So I start with the uh, first term, I basically square root it, like mentally, so that'd be eight y, eight y, and then I square root the 49, which would be seven. So I have one term, which is minus seven, and the other term is the conjugate, which is plus seven, so I don't get a middle term. You can see I get negative 56y and then positive 56y when I multiply those and those cancel. So this 64y squared minus 49 factors to 8y minus 7 and 8y plus 7. And that's how you factor difference of squares.